Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 7. Is it day 7? <laughs> I said that so confidently. It is day 7. Okay, excellent. Um, I'm in the car. I might be dying. It is zero degrees, literally zero. It's freezing outside. Um, and mum has a blood test today. So we've had to come to the doctors. But I cannot explain how cold it is. <laughs> and I'm just sat in the car. And because she was going to walk around to the doctors. And I was like, no. And then I was going to walk with her. But then because they're so busy at the moment, they're not letting people wait in the waiting room. So I'd have to stand outside in the freezing cold. So I was like, I'll drive round. So we've driven round. But now I've had to turn the engine off because obviously I don't want it to, you know, just be on all the time. So now it's starting to get cold. Um, Mum's left her gloves, so I might put her gloves on. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah that's the update that's where we are that's what's happening um the doors were frozen shut on the car um i've had to put so much de-icer on the car it's ridiculous um yeah fun times <laughs> um not much has happened yet this morning to be honest um other than other than trying to get in the car to come here um i've uploaded all the clips from my vlog i haven't edited it yet um my vlog from yesterday so i need to do that when we get back um but yeah it's so cold it's freezing we are back in the house um we i was in the car for about half an hour so i did get a little cold but it was okay um Mum's now doing the dishwasher. I'm making her a hot chocolate. Yeah. It's all go. It's all go in the house. <laughs> Hello, I'm in the kitchen. Um, so I've decided today that I will be making my gingerbread houses. Um, I said houses because I have two kits um, because I'm scared that one of them will break and I'll have to do another one. Um, a better woman than I would make the gingerbread from scratch. I love making gingerbread. Um, I just feel like I don't know how I'm going to make gingerbread house gingerbread. Um, and I thought that was just too many things I could go wrong. So I bought kits. Um, we've got these kits, gingerbread house kit. Um, and it comes with the pieces all made ready um and then it's also got the icing decorations and little gingerbread people so i've got two of these kits they were only five pounds um so yeah let's let's make some gingerbread okay we're gonna open up the boxes first if i can <laughs> Okay, so there's some little sweets. Got the icing here. I've got four different nozzles. Got the gingerbread and the gingerbread man. Got little snowflakes. Got little hundred and thousand type decorations and this which i think is to put the house itself on so let's read it's com it comes with instructions on the back so i'm going to read those and see what it needs what needs doing okay i've read the instructions um and i'm really worried this is going to be more complicated than i think it is <laughs> um yeah let's just have a go we'll see We'll see if it goes wrong we could just eat the gingerbread it will be fine but i really want it to go well <laughs>
kitchen spread my hand fell. <laughs> okay, it's ready. She's coming. She's coming, the dog's here. Come and see. Wow. Man. Do you like it? I do. Yay! Well done. I've worked out I don't have the patience to do this because ah. look, if you lick on the box, yeah, they've iced yeah. every single bit yeah. of the eaves and the yeah. roof, and I don't have the patience to stand here and do that. I've been doing it for like 20 minutes already, and that's like that's my limit, I think. So I'll show the camera now. I haven't actually shown you what it looks like. So that's what mine looks like. I think it looks very cute. Um, and I didn't need to use the other kit at all. So what I think I'm gonna do is take that kit and give it to Bianca when I go and see her in London. Yeah. And then she and her boyfriend can make a gingerbread house. That would be lovely. So I think I'm gonna do that. So if you're watching Bianca, you know what I'm bringing you. But if you aren't watching, then you don't know. <laughs> you know what we've forgotten to do yet again today? Open the advent calendar. Um, we're looking for day seven. Let's have a look. Day seven. Oh, up here. Oh, I've pulled the whole shelf out. Never mind. Day seven. Day seven. Day, se day seven, come out. There we go. Day seven. Okay, oh, it's very dark. Why is it so dark? If I move around, that's a little lighter, I feel. Okay, we'll do it. <laughs> okay, so day seven, a wish for Christmas. Go greener, literally this Christmas, and choose a replantable tree. We already bought our, um, I was about to say reusable tree, our artificial tree a few years ago. Um, just because I can't actually remember why we bought one. Was it was it because it was cheaper in the long run? Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but I do miss having a real tree. It is sad. Um, but yes, if you can get a replantable tree, get a replantable tree. Anyway, what's in here? Ooh. Oh, it's a shower scrub for normal skin, soft and smoothing exfoliation in British Rose. It's vegan. I feel like everything is vegan. Is everything vegan at the body shop? A large proportion of the things I've opened have been vegan. I don't know if everything's been vegan. Oh, that is just summer in a container. That is beautiful scent. I love that. British Rose. Lily, do you want to smell it? It's pink. Up here. Up here. Did you like it? Lily is a girly girl. She loves pink and she loves flowers. So I'm pretty sure she would be all over this if she could have it. Um, are you going back to mum? You're such a good girl sometimes. I say sometimes. Rarely. Most of the time, Mum's saying, okay. <laughs> Hello. Can you see the dog? You can just about see the dog. <laughs> um, I look very dishevelled and tired, and I am. Um, but I have just finished watching the Santa Claus of Mum and we've never seen it before and it was so charming and so cute and I really liked it um so I have a new Christmas film that I like and it was on Disney Plus so we have that so we're actually able to watch it because all the others aren't on streaming anymore so yeah I say all the others there's only like four films that we can't get but 
they're like four of my favorites so <laughs> that's why I'm a bit cross um we're gonna make homemade pizza for tea uh continuing the kind of week's meals of treat meals um and yeah I need to get up and make it but I can't be bothered really what are you doing I don't know um but yeah I'm gonna have a drink that every time I say that it sounds like I'm having an alcoholic drink I'm not right now I've got a fizzy orange but Lily Every time I say I'm having a drink, it sounds like I'm having a cocktail or a beer or a wine or something. Lil, what are you doing? Oh. Don't lick me. <sighs> this dog, eh? This dog. What are you doing? I don't know. I'm going to go. I'm rambling. <laughs> Good evening. I feel like I'm not straight here. Hang on. That probably made no difference than it did to me. So, um, yeah, so it's the evening now. Mum's just gone up and I'm down here because I'm waiting for a phone call. But... I had some bad news today. Um, my friends got COVID, which sucks. I feel really bad for her. I'm really worried that she's got COVID. Um, but it's the friend who I was meant to be visiting in London this weekend. So I'm not going to London anymore, um, which is really sad. I was really looking forward to it. Um, I mean, there's nothing, nothing to be done. Um, it's just one of those things. Uh, to be honest, I'd rather that she gets better and yeah, I just can't risk going and bringing it back and infecting mum and stuff like that. So it's really sad we were going to do all of these fun things and go around and see festive London and yeah, it's just a bit sad. Um, so I've been cancelling and getting refunds and you know, all these kind of bits for different activities. We had booked in restaurants and things like that because we were, it was going to be, you know, a really fun trip. Um, but we're going to do it in the new year at some point. Um, probably for our birthdays because our birthdays are really close together. So it will probably be like a birthday Christmas trip. Um, yeah, it's just sad, isn't it? Um, <laughs> Just another thing that COVID is getting in the way of. Um, and yeah, yeah, I'm just a bit low now um, because I was looking forward to it, but I'll get extra days with mum doing Christmassy things. So that should be fun. Um, I, hadn't, I hadn't started packing or anything, so which I was gonna actually start packing today. So that is weird that I just didn't and then I got the message to say that she got COVID. So yeah. I'm trying to I'm trying to not be really downheartened by it, but it is sad, isn't it? <laughs> I wanna be really upbeat in these vlogs, but sometimes it's hard to be when you've been looking forward to something and then it comes crumbling down no I'm joking um, I'm fine um it's just bad luck so I hope my friend gets better soon that's my main priority that's my main concern is that she gets better really soon and that she feels better I'm gonna find something to watch whilst I wait for my phone call and I think I'm probably gonna finish the vlog here because I won't be doing anything else vloggy worthy, vloggy worthy. Goodness me, I'm that tired. Um, yeah, I won't be doing anything else that's worth vlogging tonight. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow for day.
night of vlogmas. Bye!